Anything good in there? See that silliness come out of your mouth? Get you in hot water. Was well, it anything good in there? Yeah. I'm oh, sorry. I think the unique thing about working graveyard is the fact that the clientele is quite different. It's a lot of uh, the night folks where they're out and usually commit crimes. So people come in, they're mostly uh, not very cooperative, which makes our job a little bit more challenging. Right over here. <laughs> you, no. Hi. How you doing? Welcome. Thanks. Problem. Anything sharp on you gonna stick me, poke me any drugs? No, I don't, sorry. Okay, diabetic? I'm not. Can I get one of those paper towels wiping my face off? When we're done. Okay. Is that sweat or rain? A little both. Yeah. Yeah. They had me sitting in a puddle. I was asking if I could stand up, they wouldn't let me though. Oh, Hastings is a real he's a hard one. You know, he slammed my face up against a car, told me to f off with my shirt, that kind of stuff, you know, but he really likes what his did job, you do? so. Nothing, I was just standing on the corner. Just mind your own business, but... No, they said I was uh, resisting, or I don't know what he said I was doing, disorderly conduct, some BS, I don't know. When I take the cuffs off, put your hands up on the counter. I will do. Look at that. No. Put your hand on the counter. <laughs> What's the problem, man? Am I doing something wrong? Yeah, you're not doing as you're told. Oh, now no, put your hands on the counter. I heard you. Now, bend down, take your shoes off, put your shoes on the counter. Now, hands on the counter, step back, spread your legs. Can I get a Step phone call or ask Put your hand hands? on the counter. Jesus, come on. Well, come on. Okay. We don't deal with everybody that's sweet and nice, okay? Okay, I'm sorry. Anything good in there? See that silliness coming out of your mouth? Gets you in hot water. Was well, it anything good in there? Yeah. Oh, sorry. Could you tell us your version, officer? <clears throat> we got calls about a drunk male. People thought we was drunk. And uh, when I got there, he was marching around in circles on the sidewalk, uh, barking, grunting. He apparently noticed who we were and then became uncooperative, much like we've seen here. It's just funny, man. What are you doing now? I need that phone, though, to make a phone call to my lawyer. I can't call somebody? Yeah, you can. There's oh, a phone okay. in the back. Yeah, I need my phone to get the number. Is that right? Or? Not now, because he already took the battery out. What do you mean? I can't get the phone number to call somebody? No, not now. You don't get to make a phone call and you get arrested? You do. We're done. Let's go. Yeah. Well, is that not a question I can Let's ask? Well, no. you're just not that listening way. to the answers. Let's go. Is that his coat? Oh, that is my coat. coat. On the ground. I heard and you. Head that way. He's asking a then question. move. <sighs> now go that way. Passive aggressive nature. That's what my thing is. Yeah. It's kind of like one of those, like, oh, come on. I don't want to. I'm not causing a problem, but everything coming out of your mouth is. OK, whatever. <laughs> it is. It is. I'm sorry. So yeah. let me ask you this. What? Are you a good student in school? I am pretty you good. You are? I am, yeah. How? What do you mean? Well, if the teacher gave me an assignment, I could just see you saying, what the hell is this for? What are we doing with this? Yeah. Well, usually Why do I answer there, this you know? question? Come on, Paul. OK, Joe, this is very important. Okay. You can be out of jail in a matter of probably three hours. OK. Or if you become a problem, we have these side rooms that you go oh, into, scary looking. and you'll be in there a minimum of eight more hours. Eight more hours on top of the three? Right. All right, I don't want to do that. OK, so no more silly phone. questions. Like, no more I, I need to call to my, my attorney. I can't ask for that. I'm no, arrest. that's, can't ask that's for silly that. stuff. That is? OK. Because there's a phone around the corner. You can use it. You can call whoever you want. Who's that guy? Hey. It's Joe. I'm sorry. Can I ask one more question? One more. It's the last one, I promise. This better not be about your attorney. Okay. okay. It wasn't gonna be sorry, uh, dude. I gotcha. <laughs> okay, we'll have a seat. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. I'll be back. Thanks, man. Over now. Hey, Joe. Watch your step. This is uh, wet. It's wet. And you know, That's shoelaces. Awesome. I'm very impressed that you made it. To what? You, did, you didn't. You didn't go well, into a little side room. Come on. Everybody's right. different. You know what I mean? How did you get a job here, man? You're the nicest one that works here. You're just lucky, I guess. Yeah, I'm just living right on the right side. That's where we see our guys. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>
Thanks a lot, man. All right, Joe. Thanks Good luck. I'm you a hard time. Hey. <laughs> Try stand-up comedian. You're good stand-up. See, you had a good sense of humor, huh? I guess. Yeah, I tried to. Well, Joe seemed to uh, talk his way into jail. Joe just does not know when to stop talking. And that seems to be what his problem is. That's what got him here, and that's what most likely will get him back. And the doors open up, and they leave me outside. I'm gonna go home to my family tonight. I've been thinking about my home. I've been thinking about my home.